Is Miley Cyrus opening up about a bisexual experience with a Disney star? Is it actually true that Selena Gomez caught Justin Bieber in bed with Kendall Jenner? And are the ladies of Fifth Harmony revealing some new info about their breakup? We are back at Rumor Patrol. We are jumping right in with the first rumor. Yes. We've got the birthday girl, Dana Ward. Oh, it's my birthday week. It is. Okay, first question, first rumor. Is it true that Miley Cyrus is admitting to a bisexual experience with a fellow Disney star? Well, Jocelyn Davis, it has <laughs> long been rumored that Miley might be bisexual, and Lord knows there's been lots of pictures of her kissing men, kissing women, kissing all sorts of things, inanimate objects. But this rumor comes to us from Ocean Up, who actually posted the headline, Miley Cyrus bisexual reveals she has sex with girls. Was it with a former Disney star? Ooh, so that was literally Ocean Up putting a totally random spin on an interview that Miley recently did with AP, all in promotion of her brand new foundation that just launched this week, Happy Hippie Foundation, which is all about helping homeless youth as well as LGBT youth and other populations that need help. So the quote that Miley actually did say in this AP interview was that not all of her past relationships were straight heterosexual ones. And of course people mm. wanted more info, but she didn't really elaborate. She just kind of left it at mm -hmm. that. So Ocean Up really took it upon themselves <laughs> to just make up this headline. Like literally they took thin air and they're like, we're gonna construct this rumor and just post it and then people are gonna believe it and then ask us about it. Exactly, and you know what I gotta say, Dana and what? I, know the people who work at Ocean Up. We're not gonna reveal who they are, but they're- It's very secretive. They're really nice people. They do like to keep their identities secret, and they For reasons are- like this? They are really, really creative with their fictional headlines. Is pretty much exactly what this is. There was never any mention of any Disney stars. In no. fact, I don't really think we know who Miley has had these relationships No, with. she's definitely been very quiet about it if she hasn't had any relationships. Mm -hmm. Cause we've only been talking about Liam right. and Patrick for the past couple of years. Mm -hmm. So really, she'll reveal it when she wants to. But the question is, did Miley have a bisexual relationship with a Disney star. As far as we know, this is freaking false. I feel like I've made out with Miley Cyrus at this point, but I know I haven't. Are you sure? I have been to Beecher's Madhouse before. And you probably say, have made out with let's Miley. Let's just say it's dark in there. Is it true that Dana Ward made out with Miley Cyrus at Beecher's? <laughs> this room is totally true! Next ridiculous rumor of the day. Um, did Selena Gomez catch Justin Bieber in bed with her friend Kendall Jenner after Coachella last year? Oh my gosh, how long has it been that these rumors have been circulating? First off, this whole friends with benefits thing between Kendall and Justin Bieber has been going on forever. And I really think that if they were together, we would have seen some sort of photographic evidence at this point. Maybe even like one date, like yeah. one? One date. Just want to put that out there, but this does come to us courtesy of Life and Style, oh so creative over at that outlet, which reports, quote, after the Coachella Festival last April when Selena and Justin were still a couple, Selena showed up at his house and walked in on him <gasps> and Kendall in no. bed together, fooling around. Selena what? was heartbroken and literally freaked out. Okay, sounds like a soap opera, Jocelyn. It does sound like a novella all the way. And I want to point out too that Selena and Justin actually reunited for a bit after this supposed alleged incident went down. And I find it really, really fishy that mm. this is the cover story or one of the cover stories this week when it just so happens that all three of these people we're just at the Met Gala together this past week. That's where right, in New York City. People just can't let it be. There was a rumor that Vanessa Hudgens was with Selena Gomez at the Met Gala, trying yeah. to keep her calm. I don't know, I think she looked like she was doing A-OK, -okay, absolutely gorgeous. But one thing that does add fuel to the fire uh -huh. is that when Justin Bieber was leaving the Met Gala, Dana, do you recall what he said? Out of nowhere, he wasn't even asked no. about this. He just said, Selena Gomez looks so beautiful tonight at the Met. This is still stirring things up. 
just to know Selena's gonna find this out. And this also brings up a point that fans cannot stop talking about. We got this question from a viewer on YouTube. Haven HNM wants to know, will Selena and Justin ever get back together? Please answer. Only time is gonna tell. But back to the rumor at hand, do we actually think it's true that Selena became super upset? As you would, by the way, if you found your sort of boyfriend, quote, fooling around. around. What does that a even friend. mean? Do you, maybe or they someone were you know. Having okay. a tickle party or something or? Um... No, we we know when it's a tickle party and that's right. always okay. Tickle that's... parties are totally okay. Yeah, with people of the opposite sex. <laughs> tickle parties. Like maybe they were having a pillow fight. No, but like as far as hooking up, like come on. No. This is, it's stupid, Jocelyn. Let's just be honest. Yeah, this is this so dumb. This rumor is stupid and totally false. false. Okay, it's time for our next rumor. It's all about Fifth Harmony. We love these ladies. And the rumor is, are the gals of Fifth Harmony opening up about their breakups? Hmm, this is a timely, timely rumor. It sure is. I was so impressed by Ultra Fiesta. This is an outlet that's on YouTube. Totalmente en Español. So Lauren and Camila, who are both totally fluent in Spanish, took the bulk of this interview under their wings and they got super, super candid about the breakups they've gone through. So Lauren essentially said that she feels like she really needs to hold on to her privacy and that it's already difficult enough when you're going through a breakup with heartbreak and with what you're dealing with and then Can't the imagine. internet throws something onto it. I think she was really, really open because she's been through a lot with relationships specifically yeah. in the public eye. Mm -hmm. But it was really Camila that had people talking because she's been going through a lot lately and here's what she had to say. Don't worry, subtítulos included. Me acuerdo una vez que um, se rompió una relación mía y estaba llegando al aeropuerto y habían fans ahí y estaban preguntando por fotos y hablando conmigo y estaba tratando de sonreír y, y, y no enseñar mis emociones, pero no podía. Y, y una de ellas me abrazó y empecé a llorar y lloré en sus brazos porque no lo podía controlar. That was so open, but their lives don't stop because they're celebrities. Like they're going through things just like all of us. And Camila even said that she's realized that they're just all human and they're gonna go through stuff like this, but it's gotta make it so, so hard in the public eye. And I think this is a good reminder for all of us that things you say to people on the internet, they see and hear. Yeah, I mean, everyone does. But two cheers go out to these oh. ladies for being so open and I feel like a lot of fans probably connect. I'm still back at the subtitles. I'm like rereading this because I just can't <laughs> believe. I love the honesty. Me too. Good, you know, thank you to these girls for being honest and making us realize that we are all humans. We're mm -hmm. all in this together. Let's support each other, not bring each other down. Amen to that. So this rumor is actually totally true. true. Okay, that wraps up this week's big rumors in Hollywood. Some were really ridiculous, don't you think? I think all of them were super, super ridiculous. Well, the false ones. Yes, the false ones yeah. were ridiculous. Yeah. Um, but speaking of rumors, we want to know, because this is just kind of funny. If Miley Cyrus did hook up with a Disney star, who do you think it was? Oh my gosh, who would you ship her with? Yeah. And also we want to know, I feel like we talk about this on Rumor Patrol every freaking week. Can we all finally get over this whole Kendall and Justin thing? Do you guys still think this is happening? Is that why it's in the public eye? Or do you think it's false? Let us know what you think. We need some help on this one. Yeah, be sure to click like so we can keep bringing you Rumor Patrol every weekend. That's right, guys. It's so fun. And be sure to tweet us. Hit us on Instagram. Hit us on Facebook. Yes. Hit us anywhere on the interwebs with the hashtag Rumor Patrol and your questions, and you might just be featured on next week's show. That's right, guys. I'm Dana Ward with Jocelyn Davis, and we'll see you soon with more rumors. Bye guys. And if you want more of patrolling the rumors of Hollywood, click to the left to find out if Miley and Liam are really back together and hooking up at what? Soho House. What? what? And if you want to know what really, like really, really caused Ariana Grande and Big Sean to break mm -hmm. up, you can click to the right because uh, we're breaking down that rumor as well. OMG. Oh.